Hello and welcome to this technical analysis video for July 12th here at XM.com. I'm Christina Barthendi, the investment analyst, and today we're going to look at WTI crude oil futures, which had their worst day yesterday, losing nearly 5% in the wake of new trade threats from the US to China. Uh, but now looking at the daily chart, we can see that the price uh, managed to stay above 70 yesterday, uh, finding support at the 20-day moving average, despite the sharp fall from 74. Uh, in the short term, the MACD signals that the price could face some pressure since uh, the indicator has deviated further below its red signal line, uh, though it's far above zero and with the RSI holding above 50, uh, we can't exclude upside corrections yet. Besides, if we look at the Ichimoku indicators up here, uh, the red tank has a line continues to hold above the blue Kinju cell line, which means that the rebound is still possible. Uh, in this case, and if the price manages to cross above 71.16, uh, this is the 23.6% Fibonacci of the applet from 58.18 to 75.24. Uh, resistance could run towards the 73 key level uh, where the price formed the floor in the past two weeks. Uh, moving higher, uh, the way it could easily open towards the three and a half year high of 75.24, uh, while uh, any decisive close above this peak could strengthen the bullish long-term outlook as well resuming uh, the upward pattern started last summer. Uh, then the next challenge above from here could come between 76 and 80. Uh, however, if we extend lower instead, uh, the area between the 50-day moving average at 69.49 and the 38.2% Fibonacci of 68.66, uh, uh, which has provided some resistance in April and May, uh, could be a potential support to have in mind. Uh, if this area fails to hold, uh, then a stronger support could be found at the 50% Fibonacci of 66.62, uh, which has restricted upside and downside corrections in the past. And as you can see, it's also where the lower band of the Chimoku cloud uh, is currently, uh, so it should attract a greater attention because any break below uh, from here could increase chances for further downside movements. So that's all from me. Thank you for watching and have a great day.